Well, I come back today. We're not in the workshop. Oh, it's a beautiful morning. On the southwest corner of the Isle of Lewis. So we're gonna pack up our stuff and going to visit a distillery. Today it's just a case of trying to get it all dried, so it's just wood in the fire and it's got the big blower on. And that will be another couple of days before that's totally dry and then it will go through the milling machine. Once it's through the milling machine you then have your grist. Once you have your grist it's over to the distillery and that's when you start making your whiskey. How is the name actually pronounced? The name is pronounced Avi. Jarak. Avi Jarak. Avi Jarak. And Avin I shall Jarak. explain once we go to, the, I'll explain up this sign how it's, there's no V in the Gaelic alphabet. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So the V becomes V-H. Mm -hmm. That looks like the mill here. That's your water supply? That's our water supply, good clean water coming down from the hills down there, no pollution, no industry, nothing up there. <coughs> this is our distillery. Mm -hmm. Everything is done here in this room after once it comes from your maltings, the barley. Yep. Your mashed tongues, that's where your grist goes. Okay, that's your milled malted barley. You see all the maltings. Hot liquor tank, water coming in from the river. The hot liquor tank, the water will get heated up with steam from the boiler. Mm -hmm. Okay. It feeds into the grist and it gets mixed. It's just a big mixing bowl. From there you make your wats, your sweet liquid that you get from the hot water and the barley. That will come into a vessel that usually sits here called the underback and then it gets cooled with water from the river. Okay. So again at this time of year there's not enough water mm -hmm. or the river's too warm for going in the summer. Uh -huh. okay. okay. So we have two stills. We have a wash still which is for the first distillation. Mm -hmm. We have the spirit still which is sitting in bubble wrap yeah. for the second distillation. It's just come back after being away for maintenance. Mm -hmm. It's interesting shape actually. Uh, yeah, it's a very unusual shape. It's quite unusual for a whiskey distillery. It's relative to the, the kind of stills that would have been on the island. Okay. Yeah, that's the, the shape they would have been. Yeah. So wash into the wash still, heat it up, vaporize it up here to the coolers, cooled and condensed, and into the spirit safe. Spirit safe point of control, where you see the hydrometer there yeah. and the copper pipes coming out of your taps. Mm -hmm. Your first distillation just goes to the paints. Mm -hmm. That's the two vessels over here. Mm -hmm. Your storage of whiskey. Mm -hmm. From there, it would come. 
come to the spirit still, it would get pumped into the spirit still, heated up, follow the same process, up to the coolers, cooled and condensed, and into the spirit safe. Okay. From there, your first part that comes out of the still, too high in alcohol, your four shot. It goes back to the fields and it gets recycled and reused. Your middle part, your good whiskey, you would put on the tap then on your left hand side and that comes to your spirit receiver and that's your good whiskey. Okay. Third part, low wines, low wines, back to the fates mm -hmm. and gets recycled. So it keep getting reused till it all becomes good whiskey and it all comes into your spirit receiver. Yes? From there, into your sherry casks or into your bourbon casks. Okay. Your draft that's left in the mashed tuns and your pot ale mixed together goes to feed the animals. So that'll keep the cows going in the winter and feed. Yeah? Make them happy. Make them happy. Happy cows. So that's our distillery. Great. Thank you very much. And I'll take you over and I'll try mm. okay. It's a good smell in here. I love that. Right. <laughs> <laughs> this is our bonded weight house. Mixture of shed casks, mixture of bourbon. Yeah. We're releasing a single malt whiskey later on this year and that's been in sherry casks. Okay. We were going to do it in May, but it's we're only a bit behind. A different colours, just represent different years. Mm -hmm. So okay. that we know exactly what was barreled when it was barreled. Matt will know exactly when you see this barrel is whiskey, but he's he, that's somebody else as well. Uh, when he's able to release it. Mm -hmm. Or when he's obviously able to open the casks. Very, very first whiskey out of the distillery that Mark made in 2008. What he's holding on to for 10 years. Okay, so that's another two years to It'll go. It'll be another two years. It'll be August 2018 before uh, the Avant Yarag distillery has its first 10 year old. Okay. This is the first legal whiskey that we know of out of the island for nearly 200 years. So it's very important whiskey. Yeah, there have it been is. distilleries here, haven't they? Sorry? In the, in the old days, there the last, were some... The last legal distillery that they're aware of is where the Lewis Castle is in Stornoway. There was a, a distillery on the grounds there. Okay. But it was knocked down. Okay. It was knocked down by the guy that bought it, James Matheson. Okay. Okay. He was a teetotaler. Whiskey. And this one's stored in American bourbon oh, barrels. Okay. Right. Reduced to 46%. Yeah. Myself and Laura bottle in the kitchen. Okay. So if there's anything in your bottle that you buy, if the label is squint, it's out of fault. Because the whiskey is, the whiskey fumes I've got is before the clock. Mm. <laughs> 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 or maybe even long before four o'clock. <laughs> oh, Laura. Yeah. So that's basically <coughs> that one. Mm. And like I was telling you, we're releasing another single malt later on this year. That's in the sherry cask at the moment. I like that one. Yeah, at it's the moment what we have in the sherry cask is the spirit of Lewis. The spirit, obviously, because that's what it is. It is still a spirit, but exactly the same. This is a PX, Petri uh, cask. Reduced to 46%, bottled by hand in the kitchen. Yet again. <laughs> Reduced, we just take it out of the barrel in the morning, or we get the men to, depending what it is in the warehouse. And we take it into the kitchen. We filtered it, we reduced it to 46% and we bottle and we label it. So it's all Great. still here done by hand. Handcrafted. Mm -hmm. I shall leave you with Laura so I can try and give them a try this morning. So that was the distillery tour on the island of Lewis. Very small farm type distillery making a great whiskey. It really tastes great. Uh, it's just a little bit too young, but um, give it another five years or three years and it's going to be a fantastic whiskey. That's what it's called. Thanks for watching. See you next time.